Okay, so we're doing our uh, spare tire slash rim testing here. Got a big, huge stump. That's probably eight inches in diameter that I couldn't pull out with a direct pull or with a pulley system. So we're gonna do a direct pull with a rim. And the theory is that using this mechanical advantage here, as you pull the chain, this will rise up instead of being pulled into the ground horizontally. So this will rise up and over. And uh, we're gonna use just the tractor, probably about 50 foot of uh, chain and, and tie strap. And I, I will, full disclosure, I have tried this once already um, and it pulled up a six inch diameter stump relatively easily. My chain kept popping off because the stumps are really low to the ground so I don't have much to, uh, to chain to. And just to kind of show you what I'm talking about. <laughs> That's a little more than a hand's width that I'm chaining to. So we'll go ahead and give this a shot and see how it comes out. And the idea behind this is that you want your chain as low to the ground as possible so that when you're pulling, it comes up and there's not enough slack and stuff in there. So we just got it tied up. So I may lower this a bit to the ground just to give it closer Get closer to the ground here. We'll see how it goes. Stand by. So we went ahead and drove forward. Get my grand set up here. We went ahead and drove forward. And uh, look at the result. This is one pull. Look at how huge that root system is. That's probably a six foot spread there. Look at this hole there. That's crazy. If I had a tripod out here, I'd uh, set it up so that you can see it actually happening. But I'm using like a little 14 inch rim. Um, obviously the bigger the rim, the more, more uh, advantage you're gonna have. But because most of my stumps are pretty small, I'm just using uh, the smallest rim I could get. It was free. So this is awesome. Again, I can't get these with a direct pull or using a pulley. There's just not enough force because it's being a, it's a lateral pull instead of a vertical. And the uh, best way to get any kind of stump out is to go straight up with it if you can. And unfortunately, the grapple on the tractor isn't strong enough to pull these straight up. I need that pulling force. Pretty nice. I, I think I'm, after doing two of these, we're talking massive amount of roots here. Look at all this dirt. So the weight of the dirt, which I can't even do, plus the root system, I am a believer. I like it. Now I don't know that it's gonna be able to get any pine stumps out without digging, digging down, which I'll do if I have to. That'll be a perfect one right here, but I don't have time to do it right now. I'm impressed. I like it. Okay, so this stump here has been my arch nemesis since day one. Somebody cut this down a long time ago and it's just been nothing but a short little bush. And the stump's about four feet out of the ground. This is where the trash pile was. So it's grown into this, into the ground. There's two trees side by side. I've tried using the, the bucket to knock it over won't budge. I've tried pulling it, tried using pulleys, can't get it to budge. So we're going to do a direct pull with the tractor, chain, using the rim. Uh, the diameter of this one is bigger, bigger than the width of my hand. This one is the width of my hand. So we're going to see what we can do. And this is a, a maple tree. This was a maple tree. And this one, I think, was a beech tree. So, tons of roots. We're gonna see what we can do. We got roots sticking out of the ground from previous attempts, but let's give it a go. Let me see if I can set this up. 
to where maybe you can see it. Stand by. Well, so then it didn't work out. Reason being, was it dug a hole <laughs> where my spare tire was. So I'm not getting, because uh, it's just too soft. This is just loose dirt and ash uh, from the previous owner's trash pit. So it just sunk in. Too much pressure pushed it in the ground. I couldn't get enough leverage to pull this up. So again, this one wins again. We're just gonna have to take the chainsaw to it and get it down and grind it up. Where's the shot? All right, on to the next.